Welcome to Nobel Video Demonstrations. This video shows you how to use multicasting to simultaneously image multiple devices. With multicast imaging, an image is sent to multiple devices in one session rather than being sent in separate sessions for each device, thus saving on network bandwidth usage. For example, if you have 10 devices in the multicast session and the image is 3 gigabytes in size, your network experiences 3 gigabytes of network traffic to image all 10 devices. Without multicasting, the network experiences 30 gigabytes of network traffic. David, the administrator at XYZ Corporation, wants to deploy an image on several new devices for the finance team. Let's see how David uses Zenworks to accomplish this task. Before beginning, David ensures that the image he wants to deploy is stored on his Zenworks imaging server and that the multicast features of the network are enabled. David also identifies the two primary tasks that are required to perform the multicast imaging operation. He needs to configure a multicast image set bundle and then identify the target devices for the multicast session. Both of these tasks are performed in Zenworks Control Center. David starts to create the multicast image set bundle. He selects Preboot Bundle as the type of bundle to create. He then selects Multicast Image Set for the bundle category. David specifies a name that helps him identify the bundle as the Multicast Image Bundle. Ideally, David wants the multicast session to start only after at least 20 of the target devices have joined. Therefore, he specifies 20 as the number of clients required to start the multicast session. At the same time, David doesn't want to delay the session for those devices that have joined, even if other devices are delayed in joining. Therefore, he specifies 10 minutes as the maximum amount of time to wait after the first device joins the session. David adds the image, which is stored on his Zenworks imaging server, to the bundle that is created for the finance team. He verifies that the bundle information is correct and creates the bundle. With the multicast image set bundle in place, David is ready to identify the devices to which he wants to deploy the image. In this case, the target devices are not yet Zenworks managed devices, meaning that they are not registered in the zone, so he needs to identify them by using a hardware rule. Hardware rules are defined in the Preboot Services configuration settings for the zone. In the Device Imaging Work Assignment section, David adds a hardware rule that identifies the target devices. He specifies a rule name and selects the multicast image set bundle he created. He then constructs the rule. In this case, he wants the image applied to all Dell 6430 devices. When devices that fulfill this rule boot, they become part of the multicast session and are imaged at one time. The multicast imaging is now configured and assigned to the target devices. When the Finance Department's new Dell 6430 devices boot, they join the multicast session and are imaged at the same time. Zenworks Multicast Imaging makes light work of the normally time-consuming task of deploying approved images to your corporate devices. For more information about ways that Zenworks can help you manage the devices in your environment, see the Zenworks documentation website.